to the Song School Show. We're in class, she's gone with Kaha Eru. I'm Ashling. And I'm Madge. And today we will be interviewing four bands who have come up with four unique songs. Our first band today is Moody Meltdown Revolution. Let's give them a war- warm round of applause. <laughs> Ava, Nisha, Ashling, Roisin, Finia. Okay, guys, thank you for joining us here in the studio. Um, so your band has a very interesting name. Why? What is the meaning behind it? Um, well, I was sitting down and I was looking at the bookshelf and on the bookshelf it said uh, Meltdown and Revolution and I just kind of put them together. <laughs> <laughs> interesting. Okay, um, moving on. Ed, what's the name of your song? The name of the song is Go (laughs) Uh, and it's because we were practicing and one of the girls in the group, Roisin, she said go in a very funny way and we kept it going, you know, as an inside joke and we decided to put that as the name. Awesome. Um, Um, What was your inspiration, Finia? The inspiration behind this is having fun and not to waste your time as a young person. And um, what did you learn from this, Ava? Uh, we learned about the mechanics uh, that go on behind writing a song and how long it takes and how much work you have to put into it. Um, sorry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and Roshi, what was the hardest part, would you say? Um, I'd say the hardest part was figuring out the harmonies in the song. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you so much, guys, for coming in. Um, hmm? no. Oh, now we're going to listen to your songs. <laughs> What an amazing song. Um, today we'll be meeting another band, Mama. <laughs> I'm Abby. I'm Sophie. I'm Zara. I'm Catherine. I'm Clauda. Okay, guys, we have a couple of interesting questions here. Uh, Zara, what did you find difficult about this? I think the whole group found trying to make the lyrics up really difficult because we were trying to rhyme all the lyrics at the start, but then we figured out that it was easier not to rhyme them and then they just came to us. Yeah, yeah, it can be difficult uh, for people. Um, And Catherine, where did the idea come from? Um, Well, when we first sat down um, as a group, we were told to write down around 15 ideas and we wrote down childhood memories as one. 
So we wanted to write about um, something that was relatable for people our age and for them to enjoy it and be able to sing along. Wow, that's really interesting. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just like <laughs> lost. Um, <laughs> sorry. Clodagh, did you enjoy making this? Yeah, it was really enjoyable. It was a new experience for everyone making the song, so we all found it challenging, but also it was very interesting at the same time. And also we grew closer as a group, so that was very enjoyable. Okay, and um, Abby, how did the group work together? Uh, the group worked really well together and everyone was willing to take part and express their opinions. Yeah, that's important um, when making a song. Um, and our last question, Sophie, what did you learn from this experience? I learned that um, working together was really fun and but and also uh, songwriting is very challenging and I really owe massive respect to the... Um, professional songwriters out there because it's not easy okay thank you so much for coming in mama and now we're gonna listen to this amazing song looking back on when we were younger things were so simple and free but now a storm of pleasure is taking over me people told me to believe keep my dreams afloat it's not as easy as it seems to never lose hope people told me to fabulous song and now we're in the studio with Los Grena so if you want to introduce yourselves guys I'm Ava I'm Grace I'm Rosa I'm Emer I'm Ashling I'm Ava nice to meet you all so our first question goes to Ava did you enjoy this experience yes I did enjoy the experience it was a new experience for everyone and it was a fun challenge and the other Ava how did you come up with the song and um, we had two ideas. The first one was to talk about our memories, and the second one was one was about heartbreak. So we t- decided to put them into one and make a song of it. Oh, very interesting. Um, Grace, did you come up with the? Did you come up with the group name? Um, we all came up with it because the song is based on a sunflower, and sunflower in Irish is Los Grumpkin. And Rosa, how, <laughs> how did you get into music? Um, I'd always kind of been playing music since I was very young, so then it's pretty, like, I just got an idea to just, well, uh, song school came in, so it was a good uh, experience to be able to try and write a song for the first time. And, Emer, are you in the process of writing any other music? Yeah, we are. We're throwing a few ideas around at the moment. We might have an album written by next year. <laughs> wow, exciting. And, <laughs> Ashling, when did you start the ukulele? I started the ukulele when I was in sixth class. My aunt owned a ukulele, so I used to play it, and then I got one of my own for Christmas. 
That's amazing. And we can't wait to hear it in this brand new song called Sunflower. What a great song. So we're here in the studio with um the water bottles. Uh, introduce yourselves, girls. Hi, I'm Ava. Hi, I'm Roisin. Hi, I'm Molly. I'm Sersha. And I'm Madge. Um, Sersha, what was your favourite part of the making of making the song? I thought the rap was the best part because none of us were very experienced in rapping and it was funny listening back to our separate parts. Oh, wow. And Roisin, how did you come up with all of the name of the song? The name of the song is Perfect, settled with a K instead of a C because nothing is perfect and we felt the need to s- display this inner song starting with the name of the song. Wow, amazing. Um, what was sorry? Uh, what was Ava? What was the most challenging part of the songwriting? Um, well, as Sirsha said before, we're all very inexperienced rappers, so it proved to be quite challenging for all of us. But this challenge stopped the songwriting from becoming boring, and um, and kept it very interesting and exciting. Wow, that's very inspiring. Was it enjoyable? Um, yes, it was. It pushed us out of our comfort zone and we had a lot of fun writing and producing it. Okay, and um, Madge, was it good? Do you think it's good? <laughs> <laughs> I think um, the song is a certain genre of itself. You know, it's a bit country and a bit of rap, um, but it's unique and it's good. So here it is. Perfect. <laughs> Hey, 
Ava. Hey Ava. I'm Ava. Got my own flavour. I like wearing tan. My mum ain't a fan, but I do it because I can. I'm a girl with a plan that wants a good tan. Here comes the main man. Hey Roshi. Hey Roshi. I'm Roshi. Nowhere to be seen. My hair's kind of frizzy. I'm like a it's dizzy, but it keeps me busy. No point of being mean. I've been where I've been. Hey Shisha! Hey Shisha! Yeah, it's me, you know where I be, running on the track, I don't hold back. Sometimes it does harm when I break my arm, can't work on the farm. It's okay not to be perfect, as long as you know that you're still worth it. We all have flaws, it doesn't matter, it's gonna be a better day. Hey, hey, hey! It's okay not to be perfect. I'm Mako, yo yo, here we go. I'm a bit blind, things may be hard to find, but I don't mind. A message of mine, I was trying to be kind, yeah, I got Maraid on the line. Hey Maraid! Hey Maraid! No, I'm mad, yeah, that's a name. Ain't got no shame, keep my head in the game. Feeling like Troy, loaded with joy. Sometimes I'll be looking like a boy. Hey Washer! Hey Washer! It's Mission Washer Mercury, it's Kehu. Hey, go break a G of Shay, it's Moon Tour, mate. It's called Mogi, it's off late. It's Brawl, mate. Yay, yay! It's okay not to be perfect, as long as you know that you're still worth it. We all have flaws, it doesn't matter. It's gonna be a better day. Hey, hey, hey! It's okay. catchy song uh that was at the song school show today that's all we have time for <laughs> live in closhy scone and if you want to see more go to www.createschool.com <laughs> <laughs>